Live look at sunny Jacksonville Beach on this first day of 2019. The first alert weather team says we hit a record high on New Year's Day. You can see plenty of people are enjoying the outdoors on the unusually warm day. Action News Jack's Jenna Bourne is live at Jack's Beach. Jenna, lifeguards have had to increase staffing to keep up. And they've stepped up their truck patrols today. The truck on the right there just pulled up within the past minute or so. In addition to that increase in lifeguard staffing, you'll notice that most of these beachgoers, though, are not getting in the water. How cold was it? Really cold. That's why most beachgoers are staying out of the ocean with water temperatures in the mid 60s. But we spotted plenty of people relaxing on the sand. The sun feels great. Alia Munt tells me the record breaking heat is a big change from Wisconsin. But this must be, feel pretty good compared to Wisconsin. Yeah, it was a snowstorm when we left. Volunteer Life Saving Corps Captain Max Urvanian tells me there are three to four thousand people enjoying the four miles of Jacksonville Beach at any given time today. With the new year as well, uh, you know, we are experiencing a lot more um, bathers and beachgoers attending the beach than you would, you know, even just three or four days ago. It's a lot of beachgoers for winter, a time when Jack's Beach usually reduces its lifeguard staff. But Irvanian says it's only about a third of the beach population Jack's Beach sees on a typical summer day. He tells me his team added an extra officer and an extra lifeguard to keep up with the New Year crowd. Jack's Beach lifeguards helped one struggling swimmer today who was transported to the hospital. They also helped to reunite a frantic Neptune Beach mother who'd become separated from her child. Reporting live in Jacksonville Beach, Jenna Bourne, CBS 47, Action News Jacks.